Jubilee House. And then Penifu I Free Africa Export Import Bank. And who I free Africa Continental Trade. As we are a company, His Excellency Nana Ado Dankwa Ekufado. As we are a new Kudin South. So, if I get a car, I'm going to be able to get a car. I just want to, before I make my presentation to re emphasize uh, that at a Frexin Bank, um, what we see our role as uh, is an enabler of what our continent wants to achieve. Uh, we believe strongly in all the things that the founding fathers enshrined in the establishment agreement of the Afrexin Bank. We also uh, believe that we need to contribute our own quota to show the way uh, to the, uh, the relevance of institutions and why uh, our institutions should work to enable uh, things, uh, the architecture that have been built, which standing alone would not be able to achieve their goals. But if connected by the other institutions that have been created, uh, we then have a whole that can drive, uh, drive uh, uh, the work we are doing. Uh, as you know, the, this is something that is being negotiated under the FCFTA. Uh, the assembly at the 33rd meeting mandated the Fresen Bank to work with the FCFTA Secretariat and the AU Commission and the Commissioner and the Ministers for Trade to put in place an adjustment facility, develop the statutes and resource mobilization plan. The trade investment amongst ourselves. We've seen from the example of other places in the world is the surest route to delivering us out of our poverty. It is the surest route. We've seen it in modern times in Europe. We've seen it in Asia. In America, of course, has been a long-standing development. So to have Institutions that are now working not out of theory, not out of rhetoric, but concretely on the ground to find mechanisms and tools for bringing this about is an extremely important development for our, country, our continent. Ghana, as you know, has committed itself fully to participating with all the modest resources it has in the development of Africa's trade and Africa's united economic growth and development. So it's very encouraging to hear about the role that the Afro-Exim Bank has conferred on itself as an enabler of this development. For me, I think that that is something truly, truly exceptional and to be highly welcomed by all of us that an institution has taken upon itself this very, very important responsibility. Yet to work as your bono so and then a gunner man penina na 